Welcome back everybody and welcome to my new map as you can see I've got a brand new nap nap map for all of you oh my god I can't speak already um yeah I've got a brand new map it's called Serna Gora and it's in a lovely country called Montenegro and the reason why I'm doing a new map is because a lot of people were saying oh your St. Petersburg map you have unlimited money and everything's unlocked so why don't you do a second city where everything is not unlocked you don't have unlimited money and you actually got to work for the money so I thought yeah I'll get to it eventually and yeah so here I am today uh, if you're not familiar with this map I would recommend going over to another YouTube channel called Bon Bon B he actually reviews many different uh, City Skylines maps uh, several times throughout the week and he's actually actually reviewed this city very very oh this map rather very very recently and yeah so go over to his channel if you want to see a more detailed overview of this map hit subscribe you might find some new maps that you actually really like uh, let's get into it just sit back relax watch me stumble around trying to work it all out probably get irritated frustrated and relax <laughs> Okay, so here's the first part of the map for this city, and everything is all uh, locked, and it's, it's kind of frightening to me. But I'm, I'll just put it into that mode, there we go. I'm imagining this is going to be a really good fairy city. So, it looks like this area here is a nice big open area, so that's probably going to be a main downtown area I guess because it's, it's got easy access to the highway um, this would be a secondary main area as well because it's got the uh, the highway access there but but I'm imagining a lot of growth along the sides of the rivers or well, the lake and then maybe some small villages throughout the lake area and then connecting them via the ferry and then and maybe this here can be a industrial area with the port because it looks like a good open location um, yeah lots of lots of space for expansion anyway let's get into building so I guess I have to start on this side because that's my only option I suppose so I'm just gonna have to do some little ugly ugly connection like that for now just until everything else is unlocked, I suppose. So I'm thinking, um, let's start down here. So I do have some mods on still, like for example, I do have the Demand Master on, I do have the um, this one you can put the ground resources on, but I don't use that. Also the water one. I think the terrain mod is still on. Um, what else is there? Just kind of like those basic ones. There's the move it mod as well. And the terrain painter as well. Um, just some of those necessary ones. But other than that, I don't really have anything else. So, majority of the game now is like the vanilla game. Okay. Put some residential down. There we go. I'm imagining a little bit of a like a harbor here, and then the ferry or the main cruise ship can come in right into the city area, well the future city area, and it can also be a ferry hub as well. I think. Oh yeah, I better connect the road. Where do I want the road to go? Mm, like that. That'll do for now. I love all the detail in this map as well. There's so many of these little things hidden everywhere. Lots of rocks, lots of different trees. Like, for example, there's some old cars here got some logs in a random square, You've got old castles, it's a good map, I like it. So anyway, we've got some people moving in, and they need some 
power. I put put it. No, uh, I just put that there for now. Uh, they need some water. Actually, can I afford this? Ten thousand. Uh, maybe not yet, but soon. I'll just put it here for now, so it's really close by. And then the sewage, I'll just put it down. This is all going to get moved, but just to start off, it's all going to be really close by. Um, no, they don't need water. Okay, we shall get you, bring you here. There you go. Okay, and then put you there. Okay. And now we shall wait for that to connect. That's all good. Oh, good. We hit the first one. Little Hamlet. What do we get? Taxes, loans, garbage, healthcare, education, elementary school, medical clinic, landfill site. Okay. Okay. It's going to be kind of hard, in a sense, to use my town planning knowledge because, I mean, I'm starting from, like, the real basics, so I can't really put in, like, a huge main road right here or put in the... I don't know, some public transport thing. It's like, I really have to start from the bottom and work my way up. And that's kind of going to be a challenge without, without all the resources available. But anyway, it's what you guys wanted, so that's what you guys get. Does that connect straight? No. I don't think it does. Okay, let me do that one again. There we go. There we go. Good. Excellent. As Mr. Burns would say. Excellent. I'm going to continue that. Not all the way. Maybe like that. And then here, I'm going to go like this. And then remove that. Because I don't want there to be a lot of intersections here. Actually, I might go like this and just... Uh, oh, I don't have the pathway. I would put a little path there to connect it up. I'll do that later. Okay. That goes like that and that and that and that. Okay. Because this is going to be the main road eventually. So I don't want to put too many connections on it. You guys there like that. Um, put yous along there like that. I'll put the a little industrial area up here for now. Because at least then it's out of the way. Just the basic kind of squarish grid system like that there we go so probably I'll do some speed builds as well like I do in San, San Petersburg as well but just for some parts like the starting part I'll just go slow because I'm not really sure what I'm doing <laughs> so we can work it out together because I, I really don't ever play with the money side of the game. I just build and just have fun building and not worry about economics. But it's okay. I like to learn. Learn new things, try different methods. It's going to be a very interesting experience, to say the least. Okay, it needs some electricity. Like that, and that. Perfect. I'm guessing I'll have to do a really a high bridge here for the ferries to go under. So I feel like the ferries would maybe even hit that. Or maybe just miss it. But it'll be close, so I have to do a really high bridge. Okay, how's the industrial coming along? 
Uh, yeah, there's still a lot of demand for it. Damn, why'd I do it at that angle? Should have done it straight up. Okay, there we go, there we go. You you guys may have saw or may have not have noticed that I actually done a live stream uh, not too long ago playing the PS4 4 version of City Skylines. So if you want to have a look at that, go ahead, check it out. It's on my channel, it's probably the last video before this one. And it's, let's say it's, it's different, it's... It's an experience doing it on the PS4, that's for sure. It's, in a sense, it's kind of soothing because it's so, it's so much smoother than doing it on the PC because the PC, it takes up a lot of like, um, I don't know, it just takes a lot to run this game. So you can, your PC doesn't run as smoothly, but on the PS4, it's really, really smooth. Like just zooming in and out, it's so good. Even though it's kind of slower to do everything. Um... But for me, personally, I like it. Oh good, we have demand for residential again. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Put you there, put you there. I was actually playing on this map um, last weekend and I built this really great city and I was like, damn, why didn't I record this? Because it was so good how I laid it out. Oh, Worthy Village. I get another zone, district, policies, second loan, more districts and policies, emergency services, police, finally, some industrial stuff, some new policies, power usage, water usage. Aha, uh -huh. I see. Very good. How's my budget going? We're making money, so that's good. We still have demand for residential, so I might extend... A little housing estate up to here. Oh, someone's gonna have a good view up here, kind of. There we go, where's the other road? There. Like that, and that. Uh, I'll just leave it like that. Okay, quick before the demand goes away. Quick, quick, quick. There we go. Okay, there we go. Actually, I should ask you guys, what type of format should I do these this video? I mean, for this city in particular. Like, should I do lots of speed builds, or should I do it more slow and relaxed like how I'm doing now, where I talk through the whole process? Or should I do a mixture of both? Just let me know below. Because, like I said, I'm not familiar with this, so this if I do speed builds, it's probably a lot of me just like moving the mouse around like oh what do I do I can't work it out but if I do it slowly like this at least I'm talking to you guys uh, we're working through it kind of so let me know what is your preference on that 892 people 1.8 thousand oh good tiny town 900 people excellent landscaping perfect parks Parks, yes, finally. <laughs> you know, I love trees and stuff. Oh my god, finally. Finally, pathways. Okay, I'm excited. I've never been so excited for pathways and parks. Okay, where are they? Where are they? Here. <laughs> now, where was that road? Here. Oops. There we go, like that. Perfect. I shall connect it up there as well. I'm actually going to put a little connection there as well, even though it's going to demolish it. And one there, so they can get from either side. Oh well. Perfect. Uh oh. Need some power? Some more power? Do I, can I afford this one? 19,000. Yeah, I can do it. We're doing it. It's done. Perfect. Which means I can probably go ahead and delete this guy down here. And then I can expand to the other side. Uh, I don't have the train station yet. 
Um, let me see. Can I put a road? Can that road? No, oh, you can't go straight there. Actually, I'm going to cheat. <laughs> cheat just a tiny little, little bit, maybe. Can I move this? I can. There we go. Now it's kind of just <laughs> doing something weird. But let's see. Does this work? Ah, no. What the? Oops. I'll try that again. I'll move that back in a second. There we go, like that. And then I'll move it to that side. There. Great. Because I wanted just a straight road to get from either side. Okay, close that. That's the move it mod, by the way, if anyone is wondering. There's always someone who asks me that. Okay, bring that up there like that. Uh, can that go straight across? Straight? No? Yes? Kind of? Kind of, not really. Um, can't go across there, so I'll do another one here. Space already occupied? What? Uh, probably because of the, the angle. Well, I guess it'll just have to go like that for now. Um, go like that. Like that. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'll put you there like that. I might put some offices over here, maybe. Maybe? I don't know. Um, let's see. I'll put a pathway along here. And then on the other side of the pathway. Oh, I'll connect it up there. And then on the other side, I'll just put some trees. Are they kind of blocking the train? Maybe just a little. But let's just pretend that it's not. Okay. Perfect. Connect it. Why am I whispering? There we go. Uh, oh, that's not connected. They need water. My bad. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Uh, is there not enough water? What's going on? Or oh, didn't I? I didn't connect it. Ah, okay. My bad. We need a park as well. Let's do the bouncy park. And then I'll put a school. Bouncy park can go... No. Let's put bouncy park here. Do I have school? Can I afford it? 35,000? Yep. Done. And then, since it's right near the road, we don't want anyone to get run over. Or do we? No, just kidding. Uh, I'll go like that. And... Put like that, so then they have a little area to run around in, and they can go to the bouncy castle. <laughs> That's so unrealistic. Anyway. Uh, put some trees along here. We have a lot of demand for commercial, so... Hmm. Along here. There we go. Since this is more of a central area, I, f I think in the future all of this here will become um, either commercial or office space. Just because it's a more central location. What are they saying? They need police and they need... Um, what's that one called again? Garbage. Yep. <laughs> Thank God. Okay, we shall put you right there. Lovely. And they need the police. Can I afford the police? Police station, 12,480 a week. Or that one, 480 a week, 12,000. Let's do this one. It's different. And it's smaller, I think. There we go. Looks good. It's classy. Police cars in use. Three out of four. I have a feeling that the other one, the other police station has more cars. So maybe the other one is better value. I'm not sure. Let's 
see. Oh, I don't have office. Not yet. 4,000. Okay. Well, for now, it can just be this guy. There we go. I wonder if I can put a pathway underneath there. That would be good if I can. Yes, perfect. Uh, where else? Maybe I could go like that. No? Go like this. Yeah, kind of. And then you can use the Move It mod to drag it over just a little bit. There we go. Can I actually drag that down more? Will it connect? Ah, oh, perfect. Perfect. And then I'll drag this out just a little bit, like that. Perfect. Excellent. And then we need some more trees. Hey, what's this tree? I don't remember this tree. It must have been a tree that I needed for this map. Hmm. What's this one? That one's big. No, I like, I like, I like, which one is it? This one. I like these ones. They're a nice little pack. I'll put it in my mods and asset list, which is in the description below, if you're wondering. Can the train still get through there? Mm. Mm. No. I delete you. Delete, delete, delete. Perfect. And then I'll use this one just so it's more consistent. Like that. Extend you down there like that. There we go. Oh, need some water. Okay, there we go. Extend you up there like that. Excellent. Perfect. Perfecto. Um, let's just extend. We can add in the bigger roads later when they're needed. Do I have bigger roads? I do have bigger roads. I have the generic one, the generic four lane medium. So actually, hmm, hmm, like that. I should probably do a roundabout here actually. Pause it for a second. Okay, delete, 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 delete. You can probably hear my mouse intensively clicking. Okay. Like. Oops. Oops. Okay. Oh my god. I don't even have the highway. Wow. I can just use this one for now. Or do I have two? Do I have two? Oh yeah, I do have that one. Okay, just for now. Until I unlock it all. There we go. Okay, and then... I don't like how much of a little gap there is there. So I'm just going to move it over to, to about there. Go in there like that. And then this one, whoops. There we go. There, there, there. Click, click, click. There we go. That can extend up there like that. I can go there, that can go like that, and then that can go like that. Oh yeah, I need to bring this guy back over. Can I connect there? Almost. No? Yes? Excellent. Uh, in the future, I'll add in a little quick exit on from here to there. And then I'm thinking also... We'll do a second road, a straight road, like this, and then it, so it can kind of bypass the roundabout area, 
and go down over to here just as another road for fun I guess just for fun there we go oops power is not connected there and I can delete you whoops oh boomtown excellent taxi ferry yes <laughs> excited bus tram wow I'm getting all these things so early on how can I even afford them yet oh good perfect perfect timing great 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 okay we have lots of stuff now that's good so that's connected good just out of curiosity how much is the ferry not that I need it yet depot costs 33 and this one costs 5,000 oh that's that's good I want to put it like here um, do I have trains yet I don't have trains hmm interesting that I get the ferry first not the train uh, yeah, I'll fix up this area quickly there we go um, actually I know what I'm going to do and this is a good little trick that you all should pay attention to there we go like that so this one is three lanes and then it goes down to two and the reason being is that there'll be this lane here that comes off space already occupied what are you doing there we go is that still connected there we go anyway as I was saying it goes from three lanes down to two because uh, I made it so this actual lane here is actually for turning off the highway and the, the remaining two lanes just continue on down to here so it's it's good to do it that way because then that lane is only used for turning off um, what am I doing I need to upgrade 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 oh also I got like this so I noticed that if you have it like this it goes two lanes continues on two lanes two lanes two lanes two lanes then goes off onto two lanes and then between these two parts here I do just I do one lane just to show that this isn't the main way to go the main way is to go this way so I don't know it it it's hard to really explain but if you try it out I think you'll know what I mean and once this gets more busy I'll have to do proper uh, I don't know what it's called proper roads that connect from this road onto the roundabout and I might just add in some trees a decoration not that it really needs it there we go okay can I afford the high school? 24,000 yeah we need it definitely need it I'll put it here for a more central location uh, what else do I need? nope can't afford that one ah cemetery yes cemetery cemetery I'm gonna put it right next to the high school because in my hometown next to my elementary school my primary school there was actually a cemetery and a crema uh, what's it called a crematorium crematorium yeah and it was right next to my school both of these the crematorium and the cemetery and I'd always smell something and I'd be like what is that smell and I only realized probably two weeks ago that that smell was actually from the crematorium and like who who designed it like that who why would you put that right next to little kids anyway so weird so anyway that's why I put that there because it does happen in real life even though it's very weird um, put you up there like that bring you down bring you down I put in a oops a little park that one do I have my my parking lot in here I do this is my parking lot that I made by the way so it's on my asset list if you want to download it and add in some little pathways I suppose 
like that. I don't know. What am I doing? And then... Actually, no, that'll do. Like that. And then I'll just use some trees as a, a barrier. And... There. Excellent. Okay. I'm going to end the episode here because I... Uh, I could keep going for ages, but I don't want to make this episode too long. And yeah, so thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to check out my next video for this city and St. Petersburg. Uh, leave a comment, subscribe, like. I really appreciate all of that stuff. I love interacting with all of you guys. And yeah, let me know what you think of this map. I like it. It's, it's going to be good once it's more filled in. And I'm still going to keep doing St. Petersburg. I'm not going to neglect it, so don't worry about that. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye for now.